yeah. Hair's a bit of a mess because I got carts in the rain. Get sit in my comfortable gaming chair. I'm gonna stream for an hour, then I'm gonna grab me some food. I ain't kinda hunky. I'm hungry. I'm hangry. That's what it is, hangry. <laughs> Alright, let me put my uh, advertisements on. On all my social medias. Alright, there it is. Well, I'm just trying to. No, I don't want to go into creator mode. Well, I, I want to. I'm going to do offline because I haven't played in the Tekken in a long time. I don't want to lose my ranking on my gin. I worked so hard for my. I think it was my gold. If I can. I'm mean, not gold, but. You know. I worked hard on it. That's all you need to know. Load up. I got a copy of my link and sent it to everywhere. It only lets you do it on Twitter, so my my link's on Twitter. Alright, let me get... I'm not gonna read that. Give me a minute, I gotta put it in my story. I gotta put it in my story, so... People know I'm streaming. Do, 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 okay. And before I do that, I wanna customize my Nina. There it is. There it is. I mean, because uh, my, my Twitter already has it. Let's see. I, I should have enough money to. I mean, fight money to. All right, I'll make a new Nina. I mean, I already fought with Jen in my last stream, so I'm fighting with my second mate, Nina. Nina Williams. Okay, I do not like the bridal dress. So look at all the hair. Let's see, what can we get? Nah, I think I'll just fight with the default. There's not very many for Nina. You know what? We'll just go fight with the regular Nina. Nah, I'm not trying to... If they don't have it... I mean, I know I should play online, but I haven't played online for so long, so I need to get my skills back. Where is it? Yeah, classic Nina. I mean, I could play the bikini ones if I wanted to, but uh, then, you know, Twitch would probably take my stream down. But, uh, I mean, then again, if Hot Tub Meta is alright, then that should be alright, I suppose. I'm just saying, in general. <laughs> I gotta let my boy know I'm streaming too. Let me go ahead and uh, tell my, one of my boys I'm streaming. Yeah, I mean, I haven't played online in a long time, so this is me trying to learn how to rewrite a bike. See? I'm trash. <laughs> Cause I'm playing a while. Still gotta learn how to ride the bike, cause I should be avoiding those combos. Plus, like I said, Nina's my secondary uh, main. My first main is Jin, Jin Kazama. Of course, I'm nowhere near as good when I used to play Tekken 6. I actually competed in a tournament at the junior college I was in at JCC. And I actually got fourth place. I would have got first, but, you know, uh, the dude decided to cheese and play Eddie Gordo. And, well, anyone who knows, anyone who knows Tekken, anyone plays Eddie Gordo, you know you're going to have a bad time. People who play Eddie Gordo is the kind of person... And that talks about me talk about messing with your mama, you know, and probably says racial slurs in the mic. Not really, not really, but yeah, Eddie. I, I mean, Eddie Gordo mains are are, na are are really nasty, especially if they're the spam ones. They know what they're doing. You know what you're doing, Eddie Gordo mains. You know what you're doing. We all know. Fight. 
but no, uh, that's why I got fourth place at the J at uh, JCC when I did a tournament over there. But I was, I did, I did pretty well besides the spam Eddie Gordo and Tekken Six. This is on the PS3, of course. Actually, this is the only fighting game I actually got real good at. But again, I haven't played in a long time, as you painfully get to see. Fight. Plus, Nina's okay. I don't think she's an S tier character. It's not like Tekken 5. Tekken 5, Nina? Oh, yeah. No, Tekken 5, Nina, was exactly meta. Pure meta. If there was meta back then, she would be meta in Tekken 5 on the PS2. She was, she was, she was a demon on Tekken 5. Like anyone who played, you know, you go to your friend's house or play a PS2 online and you play Nina Williams on Tekken 5. Oh, oh boy. Oh, not even Devil J save you, bud. I mean, even just the arcade mode when you fight Nina Williams in Tekken 5. Tekken 5 was the best year for Nina. James, I'm gonna get that game one day. I'm gonna get that Tekken 2, Tekken Tag 2, Tekken 1 and 2, so I'll have the complete collection. This is actually my big favorite fighting game to actually play. Even though I'm wearing a Street Fighter shirt. I mean, I'll play any fighting game I, as well as I do platformers and RPGs. Round 1. Fight. This Paul looks like Nickelback, the lead singer of Nickelback, when he has the sunglasses and ponytail. Look at the king of Iron Fist! I've lost my title, Kazuya! And I play bad rock music! <laughs> I just had to meme that. Oh shit, I got my ass whooped. I am so hyper today. No, I think the best time to be a mean. Uh, man, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I can't even talk right now. I'm so hyped up. I can't even talk right now. But the best uh, time to be a uh, Nina main would um, be Tekken Five. Ooh, there it is. Let's keep going. I really wanted to customize, but they didn't have a lot of hair options for uh, Nina. So I just like, you know what? Classic Nina. Let's go. Let's go whoop some ass and call it. I'm not, you know. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Oh man, this this I think this is Tekken 4. Tekken 4 soundtrack slaps! I own Tekken 4. I remember my grandpa getting it for me for Christmas uh, on the PS2. Still have it now. Sure is the greatest hits copy, but still. But if anyone hasn't seen Tekken Bloodline, uh, go do it on Netflix. If you have Netflix, go do it. You're doing a disservice if you're not watching Tekken Bloodline. It'll teach you the lore of the game. And it's actually just a badass anime. I, I was scared because it had the Baki, uh, the Baki animation, but it actually did pretty well with that kind of animation. I am surprised. It's only eight episodes, so anyone can do it. It's only eight episodes. But if you want some anime-like stuff with fighting game stuff, uh, Tekken Bloodline's it. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm embarrassed. I'm actually losing losing to one of the worst characters to play as. Um, Elysia. Oh no, never mind. I'm doing good. Round two. Fight. <laughs> Okay, wow, I'm getting, I, I'm getting destroyed. Okay, this is a massacre, I play the victim. Yeah, this is why I'm not playing online right now, because they'd be probably be worse. Especially with Lucky Chloe players. I don't, I mean, I don't like Lucky Chloe players, because one just kept stalking me online, and kept going to the same lobby just to beat me up. I was like, bro, you won all your times. How many times you have to just kept trolling? I'm gonna do the troll. You lose. No, no, I, I, I didn't lose. I'm, I'm getting up. No, no I, 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 I do not accept. I don't consent to losing. Thank you very much. Round one. Ooh, then is that a master? That's a master raven. Yeah, they're all called ravens. Cause they're like, I think they're like a ninja clan to assassinate Haihachi Mishima. Cause everyone's got tired of Haihachi's bullshit. It's gonna be interesting in Tekken 8 how it's gonna end up being. Cause if Kazuya's the main villain, Godspeed on the Devil's Thunder. We're gonna need to have, a, this is gonna be a big, big war if it's Kazuya in control. Cause how bad Kazuya is. Oh my god, I, I let me tell ya. Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop the white suburban dad uh, dancing. That was cringe. That was cringe. That was very cringy. Don't do that. Holy shit, I was just joking. Get it. Oh! I can just see. Oh! This special. You had to have thick thighs to have this kind of special. Only Nina can perform because she's got the thickest thighs of them all. Just being real. I thought I had that one! Shit! I thought I had that one! Round one. Now cowgirl Nina Williams. Oh yeah, I want to promote this one streamer, Intra Intra Intraventus. Go follow her. She's like a body paint streamer. She's cool. She's good people. We're like Twitch buddies. I 
I still gotta follow her Discord though. I actually wanna go save him and go to TwitchCon to meet her. I can't, I can't dodge Noctis's orb strike. No, you can't. You really can't dodge. Even now, they even, even though they patched it, you can't dodge warp strikes. If you could just continue to do warp strike, warp strike, you're done. I know, cause that's the first DLC character I buy. You know, being, being a Final Fantasy head. I don't know, honestly. I mean, I have to say I advocate more for seven, but uh, for Final Fantasy seven. But I think they should have Tifa instead of uh, Noctis, since Tifa's a brawler. And Tifa would be at the same scale, level as Tekken characters. Probably a little stronger, but enough to, you know, it'd be even. But I know why they did. They wanted to promote 15. 15 put their hands in everything. They're in terror. They had something in Terror Wars. There's a Final Fantasy 14 event that happened in 15, and they were really trying to promote 15. Don't worry, 15 was a good game, but just never got to finish the final ending because, you know, fans. Round one. Fight. I actually want to bring out Final Fantasy 15 and play it again. But they got a novel that has the final ending. That has the rest of the DLC, but you just have to read it in a novel. Round two. Fight. Oh! Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah, I can't. I can't block that. I'm surprised you made a DLC character. She was only in the tag games. Kimitsu. Uh oh. What's happening? Uh oh. Oh, uh, Christine, wake up! I don't like this. Okay, it's it's working. What is it? Round one. Fight. <laughs> Oh, my cousin's streaming. Go follow Game Over Continue as well. The dude's my cousin. He's a good Mortal Kombat streamer right now. He's uh, playing Overwatch 2. Come on! Shit! Oh! Round two. I blame myself with lack of skill. I should I should get on Tekken a lot more and play more Tekken. I just wanted to switch up my character because everyone sees me play Jin all the time. And don't get me wrong, Jin is my main. It will always be my main to the end of time. Even at Tekken 8, I'm gonna I'm gonna main main in Jin.
Come on. Load up. Boot up. Round one. Oh. Fight. Fukaron. He's the Tekken Sagat. The Muay Thai fighter. Round two. Fight. This is <laughs> It was like the most relaxing fight music ever. It's the elevator music to fight to. <laughs> okay, I gotta do better than that. Oh, I like this. this is from Tekken 5. Actually, no, this is Tekken 6. That fire village at Tekken 6. I remember now. match oh lord <laughs> I'm, oh she's gonna destroy me she's gonna destroy me I'm, I'm, I'm already predicting to, I'm gonna be destroyed I'm done um I, 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 <laughs> yeah I'm I'm fucked I'm really badly <sighs> round one fight well, some anticlimactic music. I would have heat haze too playing in the background. Though it slept a lot more in Smash Brothers when you play Heat Haze, since they uh, have J Kazuya Tekken, uh, Kazuya and Smash. I'll be honest, the Technic does have the like the most litest soundtrack of all the fighting games. Yeah, no, I'm gonna lock you down. Lock down. Lock down. Are you serious? I mean, every time she summons that tiger! I get wrecked. Are you God damn it, I hate that tiger! No. Come on. Well, it's is better. Sure, I lost its special fight. That's because of that tiger. Okay, yeah, you gonna let me get up, Grandpa? KO. Round two. Fight. Get it. All I gotta do is lock the combos. Lock! There it is. Call it the leg lock. What's up, bud? What's up? Oh. 
Okay, that was good. You win. Isn't it past your bedtime? <laughs> yep. I mean, I always play Jin all the time. I wanted to try something different. This is like my second main is Nina Williams. Oh yeah, I've seen that. I mean, if you really think about with Drake, all his songs were about limping, you know? I can't say the word because Twitch will ban me if I say the word. But you get what I'm saying. All his songs were about limping really badly. You know? I mean, so I'm not surprised. Especially when he was limping for Mickey Minaj. Really badly. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh man, I'm getting mad about be having, uh, what you call it, um, what's that called again? It'll come to mind, but you know what I'm saying. A girl leading him on. I mean, hot light bling, just the lyrics alone. I'm just saying, it. it's not surprising with it because, I mean, that's all most of his music category. And then you have the Carlton uh, from Fresh Prince Bel Air dance while he was, you know, singing. Which uh, the dance was actually the meme. I remember, I remember the. Uh, <laughs> I'm just saying it, it. It's true. I mean, it is true. I'm, I'm. I gotta be honest. He does have some bangers, but yeah. I mean, th th that's the th to be God honest. Yeah. I'm not really surprised with that. With just the categories of songs he releases. I mean... And I think it's allegedly, but I think he was trying to get in the DMs of Millie Bobby Brown. You know, the girl who played Elle in Stranger Things. <laughs> yeah, which I was kind of questionable, I'm not gonna lie. That's like, oh, yeah, I'm like, yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty bad, I ain't gonna lie, that's pretty bad. I don't care how much clout you have. I wouldn't do something like that, being a celebrity. Especially because I think at the time she was pretty young. I don't know how old uh, Millie Bra Baby Brown is right now, but yeah. I think the stranger thing was... Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Big time. Yeah. Round two. Fight. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that was pretty bad, I'm not gonna lie to you, bud. You have all the... I mean, all the DLC characters? No. Remember when your PSN account got, like, hacked or something like that? It erased all of it, but I did buy, I did keep, manage to keep the ones I bought. Like, I still got to keep Noctis, I did buy, um, what's her name, Zelfania, because I like Tekken 6 so much, so I bought Zelfania, just because of my love for Tekken 6. But yeah, I mean, I'll eventually get it if the, I'll wait till a Japan sell, Japan sell, I'm gonna go ahead and buy all the season passes. 
I'm gonna go ahead and bundle up and buy the entire season pass. So I'm gonna be good there. Only thing is, uh, they're gonna give me Tekken bowling with it, which I don't know why they had a bowling game, but that's fine. I'll take everything. I can't wait for Tekken 8 though. Tekken 8! Oh! Yeah, it's a gimmicky game. I guess because they saw Wii Sports and it was like, you know what, let's do that. Oh yeah, Street Fighter 6 was good. I mean, yeah, Street Fighter 6 is good too. I like that they're going for, yeah, I like they're going for a more realistic look. I, I mean, because I got tired, of, I'll be honest, I got tired of the cartoony, I got tired of the cartoony style of uh, Street Fighter 4 and 5. I think right now we don't need that. People like how like Tekken right now is with the realistic looking characters and look at Mortal Kombat being ultra realistic and how well Mortal Kombat is doing because of that, you know. So I like that. I like, I mean, I'm already liking Street Fighter 6 and I have not even got to play it. I'm already liking Street Fighter 6. But if I do get a PS5 beforehand, then I'm going to wait and get the PS5 copy. Oh, Lord. I even like the new characters, too. The new characters are actually fire. I like the, uh, let's see. I'm trying to think of the new character. I like Kimberly and AKI, which they haven't shown no uh, pictures of AKI except for concept art. She's like a female Ve Vega. Oh, yeah, definitely uh, the new breakdance guy. I, I think his name's. I can't remember his name, but yeah, I know what you're talking about. He looks kind of like Eddie Gordo a little bit. Man, even my locks ain't doing nothing. That's what I'm trying to do is lock her out of her special. That's what I use Nina for is lock him out. Because the leg locks keep them from doing their specials. Okay, she's seen that move already. Oh, no, 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 no. I got it. Oh, oh, oh! What's good? What's good up in here? Yeah, thick thighs save lives. Final round. Fight. Nope, I'm gonna lock you out of your shit. Nope. 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 <laughs> nope. Goodbye. Yeah, I did that. I call it the Nina Lake Lock. It keeps you in the wall for the whole game. But you just gotta make sure I don't get to you first. If you can, you know, get to me before I can get to you, then the leg lock's kind of useless. But if you, if you can't, yeah, you're gonna be walled up. All right, let's go. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Okay. Man, probably won't work against some characters like Paul. Noted. Round two. Fight. Okay. Shit! 
I can't get through that. Wait, what did I just do? Whoa, that was a close one. That was really a close one. That was a real close one, like for real, bro. I really thought my ass was had. There. Change up my moves. Woo! Damn! That was that was another close one. Goodbye. That was another close one. I mean, some of these next-gen games are looking really good, though. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. They're looking fire. I'm also hyped for the Crisis Core remake. But I think I might still get that one on PS4, because I really don't know why I'm gonna get a PS5 exactly. I know that's coming out. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Oh, I think Outlast Trials came out, and the Resident Evil uh, Village DLCs already dropped. I'll be honest, I did spoil myself and watch Maximilian and other channels play the Resident Evil DLC. Round two. Fight. Oh, it does look awesome. Not just the Mercenaries mode, but even just the store with Rose. It's actually truly scary and badass. Oh yeah, on um, Outlast Trials, I'm hyped for that. Fight. Oh yeah, Silent Hill 2. It's actually Silent Hill 2 remake. I forgot that's out too. That's coming out. It's coming out. Yeah, Silent Hill 2 is coming out. I know why they picked that because it's like the best one. I guess that's like the best one. It's like how they did the Final Fantasy 7 remake. You know, they just picked the one that everyone likes. I, I don't mind. Silent Hill 2 was fire. I like the story. I think the best horror was Silent Hill 3, but for story, Silent Hill 2 had the best story. I'm surprised they didn't even do a remaster of the first one. I never thought that was going to ever happen because Konami refused, refused to make any more games. Or at least sell their IPs. You know. Oh yeah, for sure. I'm just saying, it's like... I'm surprised. I'm really surprised. Because Konami, they don't make games anymore. They make pachinko machines. I mean, remember we were supposed to have like Silent, what was it called? Hills or something? No, Silent Art um, PT. Yeah, it was PT. Never happened. So when I saw Silent Hill 2 re uh, remake trailer, I'm like, is this for real? And it is. Blooper team actually got the rights to, yeah, it does look awesome. They got the rights to make make the game, and they did. Uh, apparently so, because I'm in the trailer. Oh my god, the trailer! Woo! I'm glad they kept the slender pyramid heads design instead of the bulky homecoming design, because that one's based off the movies. They wanted to make. Oh yeah, Resident Evil 4 remake's gonna look good too. I'm surprised you got to play it on a PS5 though, because if I remember Silent Hill 4, that was a long game. And it was like two discs. If you own the PS2 or the GameCube version. I mean, I remember trying to download on the Switch the original Resident Evil 4, and it took up a lot of gigs. You would have to buy a separate uh, memory card for the Switch to play the uh, original Resident Evil 4, so I don't know how big Resident Evil 4 Remake is going to be. They might do like Final Fantasy 7 Remake and make it episodic. 
which now I don't really mind because of what they did the Final Fantasy 7 remake it's even bet almost better than the original you know besides the wait times for it so if they did Resident Evil 4 remake like that actually I could see that being good it'll probably be two episodes at best Round one. Fun. I'm pretty sure you, my theory is you probably defeat uh, uh, Salazar and then you stop the game and then you continue until you get to uh, Sadler. You know Resident Evil Village was supposed to be that long too but they cut so many parts of the game. Round I still two. think that the Lady D Fight. Should have been the should have been the last lord you fight, in my opinion. That's just my opinion, because once you get to Heisenberg's factory, the game kind of gets slow. That's the that's the thing, and that's why they had her as the first one you fight. That's exactly. <laughs> That's exactly. I would have at least liked to see her even chase you through Heisenberg's factory or the other places. She's supposed to be like a tyrant boss. Originally. I think that's probably why they did it though. They probably did to get that out of the way. And then they want to put some genuine horror when they made the baby in the dollhouse. Which I'll be honest, that's some genuine horror right there, bud. But yeah, if they do another Marvel vs. Capcom game ever, I don't think they'll ever will because of how bad Infinite was. But if they did, if they did, they'd put make La Lady D would probably be the Resident Evil tyrant character they that they put in there. Oh yeah, no, I'm not playing on VR. My, uh, my cousin wants to play on VR. I'm like, go ahead, you do what you gotta do, bud. <laughs> I'm not miss me with the VR Resident Evil. I ain't like it on seven. There's no way I'm gonna like it on eight. And seven, I thought was pretty scary, in my opinion. Oh, I have not yet. I just know that apparently Jared Genesis, you know, Jared Genesis has some beef with Morse Critical. Which is funny because it's like these that dude is a that dude is definitely clout chasing, hundred percent. Death. What Round the fuck? Two. That's like on some jigsaw stuff. Yeah. I I, I thought that was funny to be honest. Like it's like bro, you already get clown. Keemstar already got you. Everybody got you. But yeah, people are nuts. People, I mean, but it sounds like Saul. It does sound like Saul. Death may think it does sound like some some Saul. Which the first three movies were good. The rest, you can ignore the rest of the movies. I think it should end at three, personally. Now they're actually trying to come up with more of the Saul movies. Or so I'm like, please stop it. Please. You had a good beginning, middle, end. Stop. That's the only problem with horror franchises I have a problem with, is that, you know, they try to keep them going by rebooting and changing too much. It's like, can you not do that? Yeah. It just got that way. 
Like, apparently the detective was actually the new Saul, but he was nothing like him. Yeah. Detective Hoffman, yeah. And then he became a new Saul, except he didn't punish people that were doing bad in life. He just punished anyone just that, even for looking him the wrong way. I'm like, no, come on, man. Like, he took it so far that the ex-wife of John Kramer had to put a stop to him. It's like, you know... He was just killing people just for even looking them the wrong way. I'm like, are you serious? Yeah, no, that, no, no. I will never acknowledge Saw 4, 5, and 6, ever. I had the collection for the first three movies. That's it for me. That's it for me. Mm-mm. Yeah. <sighs> it's one of those things like, can you just not, can you just not? It's like what they did the Texas Chainsaw Massacre when they kept changing his Orton stories and, and changes so much. I'm like, please, can we just not? We have a good thing going. Let's keep with the original story. We don't need to have some intricate, deep plot. Fight. Damn. Okay. Yeah, there he is. Get that lock. Good. Got him. Oh, got him. Do the thick thigh save lives special. Goodbye. Next one. Okay. Whoa! Okay, that was a close one. That was really close. Damn! I would like her to say that to me, bud. Just saying. But, yeah. <laughs> no, that was. That was. Hers is the same voice actress as um, Matoko Kusanagi from Ghost in the Shell. From, I can't remember, was the uh, one that was on Adult Swim. She also does Faye Valentine from Cowboy Bebop as well. 
Because I remember her and Steve Blum were at that one Naka Kong. Let me get a new Conjuring movie. We got a lot of those movies out. I thought Insidious was gonna ever make a new movie. Did that ever happen? Did that ever come from fruition? Okay. It's a prequel. Cause I've been busy, that's the thing that sucks. I'm busy working, I haven't had time to look up on the internet and everything. Like I used to. Yeah, that's what I was saying, is that they, 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 that was supposed to come, okay, so that's July 5, 5th. Cause that's actually the one I want to see, I think that's the last one. Makes sense, cause the girl who plays and the uh, Insidious movies is pretty old. The actress is pretty old. Uh, she's been in a lot of films before. Round two. Fight. So this would probably be the last chapter. One thing that's good is that Lipstick Face returns. Yeah, that's what I was thinking that it would. It's probably that Spanish family in the cliffhanger. Oh yeah, it makes sense. They were actually, that little lore of the Smiley family, they were actually killed by Lipstick Face and brought over to that world. So they just want their life back and want revenge on the Lipstick Face because Lip Lipstick Face has actually killed them all. Actually, Lipstick and Face encouraged the girl to, to uh, the, the girl, the Smiling family, the woman in the Smiling family, to shoot her family, to make her them join with her. Well, it's funny because the Lipstick Face was actually a normal human being until he got trapped in the further, and he stayed there for so long it turned him into the Red Demon. Oh Lord. I mean, it wouldn't be possible because, I mean, that was already solved after Parker's Crane mother was taken care of in the second movie. So I think that'd probably just put an end right there. But for a flashback, I can kind of see it. Because it could be possible Parker Crane was in cahoots with Lipstick Face in the first movie. Oh, 100%. 100%. I mean, the abuse that Parker Crane had growing up, and no wonder why he turned the way he did. Like, she was absolutely nuts. Actually, that, that little, her scenes gave me the chills. Yeah. Oh yeah, hundred percent. And the fact that she she got Parker Crane to do killings for her. So all the stuff that Parker Crane was doing, what well, you know, was for her. Round one. 
I'm gonna need him with the puffer jacket. Alright, next one. Let's go. We're gonna get up to an hour, then I think I'm gonna go ahead and eat something after I finish the stream. I ain't done yet. We're gonna get through two, a couple of matches, even if it does go to the hour thing. I'm gonna at least get two matches down. At the very least. I should be hosting Intraventus' stream or Game Over Continue stream. Oh, that's right, they took off the hosting thing now. Can't do that no more. Damn. Never mind. They Twitch just took off the uh, hosting. You can't host anybody no more. Oh, I did. I did. I, that's nothing that took took me by a, a shock. It was like animated in the Death Note style as well, if I remember correctly. In fact, I didn't think it was real until I saw the thing. I'm like, that's real? You know, it was not a meme. It was real. It, it was reality. Yeah, it was reality. Exactly, that's what I thought. Round one. Does she have like steel chainsaws coming out of her anything? Uh Or is that a Husker Barn a chainsaw? Next battle, let's go. Let's go. I'll get this as my last battle, though. I really should go at least prepare me something to eat. Oh, this is Leroy. Leroy Smith. Time to take out the drag. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Yeah, Leroy. They actually put him in the Tech and Bloodline show. Oh, yeah, he was. They actually put me really... They did him really well in there because it didn't take away from the Tekken 3 lore. They added him and made it, look, made it fit really well. I will say that. You know. Oh, they need to do a Season 2. It should be Tekken 4. The story should be like Tekken 4 when when uh, they do Season 2. 100%. Because, I mean, at this point, I mean, Jin's defeated Ogre. And he'd be on the run from Hayashi and Kazuya. Because Kazuya comes back. You win. Isn't it past your bedtime? Actually, before I go, I actually want to do one customization for Nina. 
I actually want to, you know. Yeah, I'm going to go do some customization for Nina. But no, that season two should pick up with Tekken 4, 100%. 100% is. Hey, is that Android 18? Yeah, I made an Android 18 one. Yes, I did! Oh my god, I got chills. The Stern Raiders are so powerful. They steal Bonkai's. This is going to be interesting how they can defeat the Stern Raiders. Yeah, we still haven't heard him even speak yet, but my man, he was giving Biaki a run for his money. Yeah, I think I'm gonna make a trunks. Oh yeah, the Sturminers are strong. 100%. Oh, I, they steal Bonkai's! You can't, they can't do anything! I mean, they're unbelievably strong. They make that spot look like nothing. Yeah, that's gonna probably be in the last act if I remember the manga correctly. Oh, make me a trunks. I can't wait too. Alright, we got a sword, I'll make a trunks. Got like a regular sword? No. I guess that's all they got for swords. Ooh, I, I, oh, I would have customized a Nina after this. There it is. That's my trunks, uh, Lee. Okay, I, I'm gonna make Lumberjack Nina. Let's go! Nina, Lumberjack Nina. Nun, 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 nun. Okay, I'll stop. I'm, I'm getting down bad. I'm getting super down bad. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I'll stop. Hmm. Yeah. Let's get that, uh, her regular color. There it is. <laughs> okay, I'm uh let's see. Yeah, I definitely want that. I don't care about the color. Yeah, you gotta no, where's the shorts? There it is. Uh that's not shorts. I need shorts. Okay, fine, that skirt will do. Make a jean blue. You got the cowboy hat? We need the cowboy hat. There it is. The lum lumberjack Nina. 
Where is the, uh, where's the cowboy hat? I know I have it here somewhere. It's here somewhere. Is it an upper accessory? No, it isn't. Yeah, it's not. Okay, where is it? Oh, okay, there it is. Okay. There it is. Okay, Lumberjack Nina. Okay. Oh, I didn't know you could change stages. Yeah, well, it works. There we go. That's the one I want to make. I already made Android. Oh, I'm trying to figure out where my Android 17 is. I made an Android 17 uh, somebody, but I can't remember which character I made him out of. <sighs> Let me see. No, it's not him. I just made a trunks out of him. So we look out for Puffy. So Giant Lawrence. That was a Giant Lawrence one I made. I know I didn't make an Android 17. I, I know I did an Android 18 of uh, Nina. That's this one before Lumberjack. Alright, oh, well, that's alright. I'll go ahead and make an Android 17, uh... Uh, what's his... what's his face? Um... Uh, Sergey. Mmm... Oh, he don't have the hair for it. Uh, maybe maybe I can see if I can make the Lee. Because I have an Android 18. I made an Android 16 out of um, Jack. No. Let's see. Is my Android. Yep, that's my Android 16. Where is. Uh, Harangue. Let me see if I did it with Harangue. Maybe I did it with Harangue. That's Reno. I made a Reno up for Horang. In Final Fantasy 7. I think that's the last part of the stream. I think I'm going to just go ahead and customize stuff. I wish I had a scarf with mine. No. Well, actually, I could make a certain Android 17. That's black, uh... Okay. I forgot what Android 
17 belt supposed to look like? I think it's blue. Uh, let me see if we get the eye patch off. Well, it's a Android 17. So what do I got for my gins? That's a Vegito. I think I'll make a Gogeta Jin. Gogeta Jin. Let's go Super Saiyan. Alright, where's a vest? I don't have a vest? Yeah, I do. Well, if I had to do a shirtless, that's fine. All right, I need some hair and pants, because that's what Gogeta wears. There it is. Okay, there it is. Yeah. There it is. I'm trying to get rid of the gloves. There, go Gina Jin. You gotta get that Super Saiyan aura. Gogeta Jin, let's go. What's up? No ponytails? Damn, I was gonna make it Terra Silver. Hmm. Never show you. Oh shit, I'm gonna make me a cloud. This is gonna be easy. I'm gonna make me cloud.
I actually keep that red, but the Kingdom Hearts one. Here it is, there's our cloud. All right. Uh, got my cloud strife. Final Fantasy 7 right there, buddy. Final Fantasy 7 right there, buddy. Yeah, boy. Me guts. Yep. Make me a guts now. Yeah, all black. Oh shit, I can't even make a Vincent out of this. There it is. There it is, Guts. There we got Guts from Berserk. Much better made an Elden Ring, but why not? Do I have a long hair gin? I could probably make Vincent out of that. No, I do not. I do not have such things. Uh, we'll just do one more Nina and then call it a night. Now it's time to make sexy Nina. So I can beat people online. If <laughs> I distracted them. Oh, that's gonna be funny. I can beat their asses by distracting them. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm, let's see, we're, I'm doing it, I'm, 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 I'm so doing the bikini. Oh yeah, so I'm taking the wedding thing off. There we go, there we go, <laughs> oh yeah, that's what's up. Oh yeah, this, will, this, I just, we're gonna distract players online with this. We're going online with this. If we do, <laughs> distract in a fight, let's go, let's go. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm, I look so down bad on stream. Oh my god. <laughs> I think I made a Bruce Lee one. I'm gonna go ahead and make Lotto Bruce Lee. This is what he's based off of. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna cut the stream off after this. I really got to eat. I just want to get the whole. They got the whole yellow jumpsuit? No, they do not got the whole yellow jumpsuit. How do you not got the- Oh, I guess probably for copyright reasons. I guess that makes sense. 
damn. <sighs> of course, it's copyright. Did I do anything with Hachi? I can make the Duke in Resident Evil uh, Village. And I think I'll probably do that. I'll make the Duke from Resident Evil Village. The DLC. Okay, I need a butterfly mask. There it is. There it is. And then he's gotta wear a suit because the Duke wears a suit. You don't have no suit for him? Why do I have no suit for him? What, what's going on? They don't have no suit. Oh, there it is. Well. Well, you gotta make... Gotta make do, do what you got. Slacks, bro. There we go. We got the Duke. You know what? I'm gonna see if I can make Lady D. I'm gonna make Lady D next. I'm making Lady D. I'm. I am. I'm gonna make Lady D next. Okay. Yes. Smart. I'm gonna make me some Lady D. I forgot what she looks like. I need to go look up Lady D. Lady Dimitrescu. Let's go. Alcina. Okay, you need a big hat. You need her with short curly hair, so let's get that short curly hair going. Well, they don't have the curly hair like she has, but... At least it's a bob. Mmm. need it shorter than that. There it is. Yeah, we'll make some Lady D. Resident Evil Village, let's go! Let's see, you got a white dress? I mean, even a wedding dress would work. You don't got a white dress? Oh, come on. No. This guy's are clothes. Yeah, I guess I gotta make everything like Lady D's as much as I can. As long as I got the big hat on her. Should be Lady D. Well, the legs do show. What was that last one? Oh, the. Well, it's the best I can. It, it's the best I can do. No. As long as she's got the big hat, it don't matter. Okay, we got another hats. I guess that's the best we could do. It's close to it. Now I should just have long hair. It's young Lady D. It's Lady D before she got the Cadeau Parasite. As you already got, Kai got the claw anyway, so. There it is. We got Lady Demetresk in the house! Hey, Lady Demetresk. I got Lady Demetresk right there. So we got some Resident Evil characters. Let's go with that. Hmm. Yeah, 
Yeah, we'll just call it go, go right there. There it is. May the crystal be what you think for being on the stream. 